Hello, people. It is me in my wrapped head towel glory. Doing the Erica Badzu look. Whatever. You know that heifer is the only one that can pull that look off, not me. Um, so, I want to tell you a little something. I got the biggest surprise today in the mail from my friend Stacy. Hey, girl. Thank you so much. We were talking, um, I don't know how it got started, but I told her about the Berry M, the crackle polish look. They are off the chisane. I like, can't quit looking at my nails. And I did my thumb in pink. Anywho, so I can't find any kind of crackle around here. And of course, um, I don't know who first, I think a long time ago in the 80s, they came out with this crackle stuff and you know how things fade out and come back again. But um, I always wanted to get my hands on some Berry M. Panacea 81 has always been like using the dazzle dust and stuff. And I always wanted some Berry M. So now I have it. And I'm just so, like, thankful for this. But she didn't just get me that. No. She went way, way overboard. Stacy, you did, honey, you should get a de tax deduction off of me. You and Laura need to get a tax deduction. <laughs> y'all need to claim me and y'all's taxes. But anyways, um, she's from a town called Portsmouth. Um, it's a big, it looks like a, um, a place where, hello, there's a port and there's boats, really pretty old school looking like ships. And her little postcard says, just a little something to say thank you for everything. You are a beautiful person. And don't ever forget it. Your videos make me laugh and smile and give me hope that one day I could be as awesome as you. I hope you love these little trinkets. Nothing major my behind. It is to Stacy, Gideon, and Prentice, her two kitty cats. Um, let me adjust this. Um, she has two cats and Gideon and Prentice is their names. And she will not get on here and make like a tutorial. She's gotten on and shown her tattoos and stuff, but I don't know. I, I guess she's just shy. But I would love if you would do some tutorials. That would be really cool. So let's see what all she got me. She is also a Hello Kitty fan, as I am. Y'all know this. I have a Hello Kitty toaster. I have a few bits and bobs. I'm English now, bits and bobs, but um, she got me Hello Kitty candy, which yes, I'm going to save the boxes. It melted a little, which is no problem. It is chocolate. It will not go to waste. <laughs> I will eat it. I put it in the freezer, so it'll hopefully harden up and I will eat it. I do not care. I will eat chocolate. <laughs> okay, and then it all came in this beautiful like box it's a very sturdy box and um this little kitty cat is made out of i'm thinking it's made out of some kind of wood can y'all see the kitty see there's this face and then and then he sits like this like he's stretching very cute very very cute and he's so so delicate so lightweight i'm gonna put that on my little bookshelf over there with I have Bratz dolls and angels and just all kind of weird stuff sitting over there then my nickname is Pooh but sometimes I can be a Eeyore um, I do suffer with depression and I've had a hard time of it lately and that's why I haven't been on here because I think nobody wants to sit and watch somebody be down in the mouth and sad and when I'm depressed, I can't pretend to be happy. I've come here and tried to be like, okay, let's do a tutorial. And I just cannot make myself. 
but this right here just sparked my mood not because of the things but because it's just the thoughtfulness of it and that someone thinks that much of me like wow but um this is Eeyore and it says happy smiles with his little tail and his little bow I love Pooh there's a movie coming out near my birthday about Pooh too then I got a Hello Kitty notebook which I love these little notebooks I use them for everything I love stationery love Hello Kitty even loved little apple designs when I was a kid I had a backpack that had apples on it and I loved it and then the inside pages are decorated too with Hello Kitty <sighs> love Hello Kitty I would love to work for the company that designs Hello Kitty <laughs> y'all will not believe this it is so adorable I have never had any Hello Kitty jewelry ever ever look at this She's done up like a little devil. She's got <laughs> she's got little horns. She's got a little devil tail. So cute. <laughs> she's being bad. Then Oh y'all. Time I ripped into this thing. I grabbed out the polish and then I grabbed out this. I at first thought it was a candy cane. It is even better than a candy cane. It is some sort of like cotton candy tasting sugary goodness. <laughs> it says South Sea Rock and it's basically sugar, glucose syrup flavors and that's it. So it's sugar but it tastes like cotton candy, okay? Love that taste. Then, okay, we have Revlon here in America too, people, but I have never seen this. It says soft on the eyes, Revlon. Looks like that. It's just very basic, very sleek. Then you open it up, and it has, of course, the little wand to use, which actually works really well for what this is. And can y'all see those little pots? They are for like, they're kind of like Dazzle Dust. They're, um, they're pigments, but they're very um, pastel. I forget what they say on the back of it. It says, Sheer Loose Shadow. Head in the Clouds is what this little quad is called and see when you close it I don't know if y'all can see these little nibblies up here see the little nibblies up here that is the cap for these little holes so you could travel with this very easily I'm gonna swatch them they're just very pretty very sheer it'd be really good gift for like a teenager who's just starting out in makeup you know and you don't want her to go behind crazy and put a lot of loud colors on her face. But these cotton candy, very sheer colors have been in style for spring. I know I've seen them, Essie doing fingernail polishes in a lot of these little pastel baby shades. Is that going to show up? <laughs> Let me bring my, dang it. I don't know if y'all can see. I can see the purple and the blue. The other two are like iridescent. But it is beautiful. It is beautiful. I will be doing a tutorial with those. Thank you. And then, this is bourgeois. I got me some bourgeois. I don't know how to say this in the beginning. I was calling it bougie. I was calling it all kinds of mess. This is Bourgeois Corrector. It says anti-cringing stick, but I'm thinking that must be French for crinkles, for wrinkles, 
something like that. And look at the packaging. It has little leopard print on the package. Then, clean the mirror. Look at yourself. Hey, hey, y'all. Isn't that so cool? The little mirror on top. And this is a very creamy. It goes on very easy, and it's very. How I can test it, I have a freckle on my hand, and if it covers the freckle, that's how I know it's a foolproof, full coverage concealer. And it matches my skin perfectly. Homegirl, you got my colors. You got my colors down. Then, I know it just continues and continues. Um, Makeup Academy. I've never had any of these products. This purple eyeshadow, it's called, it's number 18. I wish they would make names for them. It's a matte purple. This one reminds me of that famous purple one. Is it Philosophy? It's a, one of those. Y'all message me below and tell me what it is. I know y'all know what it is. That famous purple one that's big and round like this. Love it. Love my purples. And then I've got two pencils from Makeup Artist Academy. And they are in royal blue and bright orange. And I love the fact that I got some bright orange. And I mean, it, they are so smooth. They go on so smooth. That's the blue one. And they have a sharpener up at the top which is so convenient you don't have to be looking around for a sharpener I haven't opened this one yet let me open it I don't want to have to edit I'm just gonna slide this thing up I thought no homegirl deserves me to put this up tonight because I was gonna wait because I need to dye my hair yada 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 I've been meaning to do it for ages now look how creamy that is and I did not blend that I did not blend any of those that's just how they came off on the pencil so that's really good when they don't skip and when they don't have that waxy look in them where you have to like smooth it out very good beautiful I love it thank you I feel so loved okay and then this is another makeup artist um, liquid eyeliner in shade one. Uh, I tried this on my hand and it looked a little thin, but what it does, you put it on, it's a liquid, just regular eyeliner, liquid liner. You put it on and you're going to have to let it set and then go over it once more. And it dries. It's like um, paint. It draws a shade darker, really, I noticed. But I love my greens. I buy lots of greens and purples for my eyes. So thank you, Stacy. Love it. Then I got this little mini bourgeois lipstick, which I love because I am going on vacation this summer. I'm going to Arkansas. Woot woot. Um, I don't know the name of this. Number two. Number two. And it is, when I got this, they had to leave it on our porch. I don't know why they didn't ring the doorbell. Hello. But um, it was a little melted feeling, like it wiggled in the bullet. So I put it in the freezer for a little bit. So if you're lipstick ever melts some just put it in the freezer it's a really pretty really pretty bronzy color it's right there that's it beautiful and it looks like it can go on a keychain or like your cell phone maybe like one of those I don't know, but it's cute. It's tiny, and I love it. Also, where did it go? 
Oh, there it is. It came, a lot of the stuff came in this clear bag, which y'all, clear bags are awesome for travel because you don't have to go digging and getting all your crap out everywhere. You can see where you're going, see what you're looking for, and grab it and put it back. My biggest thing when I travel is when I go to leave, packing and making sure I take everything back with me. You know, I don't want to leave nothing. Anyways, this is smoke screen, smoky eye kit. Look how cute that is. It's like old school comic book looking. Like when you get up close, you see the little dots, little pixelated. Too cool. Love that. Then you open it up. And it has got three eyeshadows in it. A black, which I love, and it comes off so easy. I love a good black. Sometimes it's, it's hard to find a good black that goes on full strength and blends easily. So those are the three colors. You've got a shimmer. You've got the gray that has kind of a sparkle to it and then the flat black and then you have let me see if i can hold it a black pencil a white pencil and then you have two little brushes in there that come in there oh hello and the brushes actually look like they would do a good job let me test it out It's sticking to it. It's a this is a synthetic brush. Look at there. It went on. Right there. So the brushes work really well. And then up at the top, it gives you different ways to do the looks, which I think is really cool. I've not seen anything in the States like this. It says um, Primark Beauty Dublin. Pretty cool. I ain't never had nothing from Dublin. Oh, let me clean my hands, y'all. Let me clean my hands. Makeup remover. Excuse me. What I'm about to touch, I do not want to get dirty. <sighs> oh. While I'm sitting here cleaning my hands, please, please, please go to Laura's page. She is under the weather right now. Um, I don't know if y'all know it. I know, I don't think I've ever heard her talk about it like directly on her channel. She has kidney stones. Um, or no, gallbladder stones, my bad. One of them stones and it can put her in some severe pain and y'all, I know y'all love her too and that's why she has not been on so please go to her channel and show her some love leave her a nice comment on her on her page send her a message let her know you love her I, and I feel so bad for her you know if we weren't across the pond from one another I would go over there and and help her out I love her then I got one of the coolest things ever and I don't know if anybody in the States has one of these and I just I'm like yay and Daniel's like I'll get you a frame for it. Look at this awesomeness. <laughs> Catherine and William. Can y'all see it? It's got their, their names. 2011 how friggin awesome I think she is so beautiful I think they are both so down to earth and I just the only thing that saddens me is that I wish that his mama could have been there because 
I know she would have just been so happy. But I have a feeling she knows anyways. I know I'm not from England, but I do have a thing for Diana. I have a book on her, and she's just a very loving, given, kind, beautiful, beautiful woman. But <sighs> thank you so much. Stacy, Prentice, Gideon, and you man, I know you got a man. Thank you so much. Oh, also, crap a mighty, I'm forgetting. She gave me this Dermalogica, Dermalogica Gentle Cream Exfoliant. Thank you for this. My skin has been off the reservation. I don't know if it's my hormones, maybe that's why I'm depressed. I have got dry skin that like I can sit here and like peel off like huge chunks of it and it's just so rough. Normally I am a manageable oily person which I can handle oil because as long as I cleanse daily I'm good. But lately I have all this is breaking out on me which I know that's hormone gotta be. So. It just makes you feel bad when your skin breaks out, you know? And just thank you so much, honey. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You just don't know, you know? And it's so hard when, because I know a lot of y'all feel me, when you're broke and you don't got a lot of money and you go to town and you see things and you want them, but you can't buy them. And then somebody does something like this, it just, bless you bless you for doing it and I thank you for doing it my man did get me the Nivea soft moisturizing cream Nivea is a good brand and this stuff feels so soothing because of me having the dry skin yeah. Stacy honey you went over the moon you really went over the moon honey and I love everything and I thank you for everything and I hope y'all are having a beautiful day. And I'm just going to sit here and look at my nails. I'm going to do my toes too. So y'all have a beautiful day. I know I've chit-chatted and chit-chatted. So peace, word out, love y'all.